please. My name is Sergei Kraven. Men call me Kraven the Hunter. So you left me that note. Huh. Judging from the wet, I'm one of those crazy reality show guys who runs around naked in the woods eating bugs. How come you help me? I can make you a true hunter, not just a boy pretending to be a man. Should you wish to accept, you may find me here. Until we meet again. Why are you checking your credit score? You don't look mom and dad forever, do you? Oh, sorry, Mr. Jameson, but I've got school. You know, life outside the job. That's what I forgot to put on the soul down. Credit card. Give yourself some credit. Check this out, bro. What's that, bro, him? I switched to Geico and got more. More savings on car insurance? Yeah, professor. And more. Like renter's insurance. More ways to save. Nice protated chip. That's not all protein shake. Geico has motorcycle and RV insurance, too. Ooh. That's a lot more. Oh yeah, all about what Jenny Bros is about. Geico, expect great savings. And on you. Actually, I just got an idea for using the press pass. Oh, look like. Gotta admit, it'd be nice not to feel like I'm fighting this battle on my own. This Craven's someone I can trust. Craven obviously doesn't know who I really am. Would he come to my house? I don't know. We've always, always worked, worked best, best alone. alone. But, but then again, I've never tried, tried it any other way. way. If Craven can teach me his hunting techniques, I don't have to rely on police broadcasts to find bad guys. It's not like I tell Craven my real name. And I'll be on guard for any kind of double cross. I've never had formal training. <sighs> okay, don't be nervous. We need information on Craven and you've got a press pass to get it. <laughs> Is it easy? Never mind that if he finds out you're a photographer and not a reporter, you'll have your stuff to mount it. Oh god, I can't, I can't. <laughs> oh god, I got stuck. Really? I, oh god. You can pretty much tell this is Raven. How? Uh, Mr. Craven? It's me, Peter Parker, from the Daily Bugle. We spoke on the phone. And Mr. Craven? Tigers are in danger. I simply relocated the beast for its own safety as well as that of the local villagers. Do others wish to conserve the natural world? It is where you find the beast. We're a long way from the natural world. I craved a new challenge. I came here to hunt the monsters Oscar created. Cross species. The deadliest combination of animal and human. I ended their threat. But I am fond of your city. And your city is fond of me. 
I decided to stay. Except now you're here to normal people. No. Only criminals. Only those who pray and fellow man. Anything to fear from me. Technical knockout weighing in at 67 pounds. Carol, put on your Sunday clothes, Jenny. This new task force is sending a pretty strong message. No vigilantes. Uh, I do not trust them. They are paid for by Fisk. I am sure of the rules of his illegal activities. Sure, everyone wants, but no one can prove it. And the police are okay with it. Because he has paid those who are corrupt. The rest are desperate to avoid looking incompetent. The public is desperate for an end to the crime wave. I have only one agenda. Get the results. Based on my experience with the research, the police aren't big fans of vigilantes. The police have their chance to stop the crime when they fail miserably. I uh, don't think they like being reminded that I don't know how she can solve them. But it would be a far greater crime to have the power to help, to refuse to act. Would you not agree? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I would. Hey Peter, I was going through your garbage and I heard man really, really the most dangerous game. In their own way, yes. But the men are merely the highly evolved elements. The current crime wave provides fascinating opportunities to study them. At least the various options. I mean... So you're saying you feel a responsibility? Spider-Man captured them. 
an inadequate solution. They escaped. So you killed them? To save the lives of their victims, yes. That's not saving them, just frozen. They look like they're frozen, too. I know. I mean, I, mean, I can imagine. Are you killing Bray? When do you consider it okay to kill when there is no other choice? I don't intend to take life lightly. It is necessary. Do not hesitate. Did they got his voice right, but his face is like his beard and everything? It's out of myself. What do you mean? If you're a mom, you call it the worst time. That's what you do. They all had superhuman powers. How'd you beat them? I have trained myself to the peak of human ability and learned many natural means of enhancement. Not drugs like the scum who pollute the streets, but the secrets of native cultures. Herbs, potions, mysteries forgotten by so-called civilized man. Hunting criminals. Some people might wonder if you're the carnage killer. Ah, he is no a hunter, but a brute, a savage. His very existence is offensive to men like myself. So even though he's hunting criminals, you'd like to take him down? Of course. He dishonors what I do. Without honor, Peter, the hunt means nothing. Last question. Is there anything you haven't accomplished yet? Uh, yes. I would like to leave a legacy when I am gone. Pass my training to a protege. My only family is a brother who um, he chose a different path. I never had a son, but perhaps. Uh, forgive me. I am becoming melancholy as I get older. So, do you have what you need, Mr. Parker? Yeah, I think I do. I gave Whitney Chang. How'd you get it? The name's Black Cat, as in cat burglar. As in I get my hands on things I'm not supposed to. How about you, Spider? Do you ever get your hands on things you're not supposed to? I heard you were back in jail. Listen, if you're calling to tease me about breaking out... I'm insulted. I can think of a lot more fun things to tease you about. If you're smart, you'll get out of town before I find the time to chase you. Funny. That's what I was going to say to you. Things are getting dangerous around here, Spider. Why don't we chase each other out of town? I'm too busy to fool around with you. I, I mean, play games with you. Bye, Felicia. Hey, um... Yeah. In the video. Right here. I'm really excited to have people. I think he's going to make a great addition to a great team. I want to thank God. I want to thank the Lord God. 
Uh, because it's not really up to me, it's up to him. <laughs>